Hey everybody, look what just came today. Yeah, it's my new green Sears table fan. By Lasco, of course. I just got this today. Uh, I paid quite a bit for it, like like around 120. But it was worth it because this thing is like near mint. I'll have a look around it. It won't fire it up. The blades on this are nice and green. Seems the blades on my old one aren't aren't as deep a green as this. I guess the blades on the old one uh, kind of faded a bit. If, if you look and see the plastic's nice and white. On the other one it kind of faded a bit, kind of went kind of off-white. Not really yellow though. But this is uh, like perfectly white. And, as you can see, the base still has all its hardware. It didn't have a piece of the plate missing and no unsightly glue marks. Zoom in on that Sears uh, label. It does have a few... Uh, Little dings on the plate, but not bad. Right. Don't expect to be all that perfect. And the cage uh, has all its clips. I don't have to use any zip ties or anything. So we'll have a look at the fan from other angles. There's one side. Turn around to the back. Here's the other side. And we'll have a zoom in on that that stylistic S and R logo or the atomic logo as some of y'all like to think of it. Or the butterfly. Now let's see it run. Here's high. And the button just stays down. Don't have any contact issues or anything. It moves great air. Medium. Low. Turn the oscillator on. That's low with oscillation.
now medium with oscillation. with oscillation. Disengage the oscillator. And now off. And there you have it. This is my new 1970s Green Sears oscillator. And I got the old one uh, all packed up and ready to go in the same box uh, the new one came in. So there it is. Thank you for watching, everybody.